Hello! Welcome back to the Hellish Nightmare. We are in episode 27 now, guys. And it is fucking intense, I'm telling you. It is a lot harder. But look, we have the face cam on here and the twitching stop. Strange. I'm going to have to load up the game a couple of times while it's recording to see how it goes. Because there's no... This is smooth. This is smooth as butter now for me, do you know what I mean? No health. Some health would be nice because we're really low. But we do have the soul cube up. We'll maybe use that in a big monster. So we were at storage there. No! Well, we don't want that gone. Oh, we'll go central processing. I think that's where we were. We'll try the CPU bank. Hopefully that's not where we were at. Yep. So we know that's not where we go to near the end. CPU bank, storage, server bank. Central processing. Right, server bank it is. Let's give it a quick save. I need healed up, my man. Maybe there's health about you here. Just a clip so far. You crafty crap, die. Heal me full, heal me full. Oh yeah. That's what I'm talking about, man. <laughs> well, fuck you, Tim. Fuck you right down to the core. Where you at? Where's the other one at? I hear a zombie coming. Where are you at? You're down there. What are you doing down there? You go to your own place. Right, obviously he's coming, yep. Sort of swung that prematurely there. Gruesome. Gruesome. Just ripping boys apart. Oh my god, not these things. We have very little ammo for the worst reason. Let's just shut on them. Use us. Put the check behind me there just in case. Here another one. There's definitely two. Maybe there's not. Get this reloaded quickly. Keep the soul cube for a big dude. Like an arch file or a revenant. I heard an imp there. Where you at? In here? Yep. We messed with the grenade. Oh, I bounced back and hit him, but I didn't kill him. Thank you for the health. Most appreciated. <laughs> They're not doing well, the enemy, this time, are they? Well, I don't want to speak too soon, because it could just bombard us with a pile of stuff. Oh, PDA. I love these things. BFG. Something that I've barely got to use throughout this whole playthrough. Let's move away from that and we'll read this PDA then. I can smell your fear. I can smell it too. Right, let's read this. Who is it? Steve Toulouse. Toulouse. God loose. Storage problem on server. Steve, I've been noticing a steady degradation of the file system performance in server A12. Could you please head up to the third floor and look into the problem? I'm working on the matter transference problem for the guys in Delta. All my data, all my data is stored on the server. On that server. 
If we have backups from last night, could you please restore them? F restore them to server A17 if it's not in use. I can patch into this into that server to continue my work. Thank. BFG video info. Steve. Corporate needs the new BFG video placed in your office. Upload it to the server and placed on our internal website. Don't forget to convert it to a uh, UACMOV, whatever that is. So it'll play on all, t all terminals. Fire me an email when it's up. I can't wait to see it. Brian. Alright. Quick save that. Just to make sure we're not missing anything. Any ammo, any goodies, a door, something. Because we're going back again. My mouth's really dry. I need a drink of water. A couple of green tea. That's what I need. That's what I would love. Itchy nose. Oh, would you look at that? What the fudge did we get over there? Oh, yeah! Excellent. Excellent. I didn't think we were going to make that. I just seen that in the corner of my eye there. That was nice. Thank you very much, Tim. You have redeemed yourself, my friend. What is this? Man, that was up close and personal, hang. That was ugly as fuck. Why do we keep bringing the rocket launcher out? Yeah, that's what we're looking for. So... Central central processing, that's where we're going. Oh, that must have been not PDA. Did that die? Good surely. Sergeant is waiting for me and he's waiting to kill me. We will soon see about that. Let's give it a quick save. Video disc. Let's see what it is. I didn't watch any of these here. User data, personal, video disc, briefing. Yeah, we'll watch this. Representing the pinnacle of UAC research and design, the BFG 9000 is the most advanced firearm ever designed. Fully self-contained and deployed as a handheld platform, it is capable of an excessive amount of firepower. The BFG-9000 contains sophisticated friend or foe technology that discriminates targets in real time. Each projectile contains a small but very powerful computer core that actively maintains targeting and delivers a stream charge down each beam to soften targets before detonation. The detonation stage of the projectile is devastating. Targets within 15 meters of the flashpoint are not likely to survive. While not recommended for small quarter combat, the BFG-9000 is ideal in the field and against multiple targets. The only foreseeable defense is small arms ballistics. If the projectile is destroyed before exploding, the computer core cannot process the final fusion reaction, resulting in a less than optimal detonation. For more information, contact the UAC's Advanced Weapons <coughs> Not phlegm in my throat. Fantastic. Although we don't have a BFG. Obviously this is going to be a boss fight. Whoa. Does this work against them? Oh, he's got the BFG and he's ragging me with it. Where do we go? Any health? Okay, I don't know how we do this. Where's he at? Oh, he's there. <laughs> I don't know what we did. He's obviously dead. Where's that BFG at? There we go. BFG multi stage weapon. The longer the trigger is held, the larger the charge. Be careful not to overload the gunner, it will blow up. Alright. Finally! 
Finally we have a fucking BFG, a big fucking gun. Any sales for it? I'm gonna go with the four. I don't know what we did to kill him, but it worked. And I'm taking that as a win. That's not the way that we go. What way did we go then? Get back. Ah. Piggy devil. Hiding that. Oh man, we're back at the poison area, I mean, you might not. Or maybe it's not, it just looks a bit like it. Get everything loaded up. Everything is reloaded, apart from the shotgun. Site 3 maintenance. Pick to exit main processing. Alright, on to the next level. I suppose these are levels. Site 3. Let me out, let me out, let me out, let me out. The textures in that door is terrible. Right, that's bad. That's what I'm talking about. It's the first or well, the second time we've seen an imp. Well, not an imp. The Hell Knight in the base was fought too before he went to hell and then they were all in hell, but obviously they're here now. Gain security clearance for all site 3 areas. I think I'm hearing. Oh! Keep thinking I'm hearing a Hell Knight walking towards me. There's one. There's one here somewhere. I can hear it. Yep. Look at the size of that mofo. I don't know what killed me. It must have been a barrel behind me. Did we not quick save this? I will use the soul cube. Nah, no, we have plenty of barrels. We'll destroy these barrels. Get them out of way. There we go. Come on in, Hell Knight. What? He just blows right. That's just cool. There's nothing any match for that at all. Storage, let's go into the storage. Some BFC cells, gels. Some BFCs, BFG cells would be nice. Talk right, your game. How do you say words? Get me out of here. Cheap shot, cheap shot. Are they blocked in there, they are. Oh, there's a maggot. Come see all in a while. Oh, don't you worry, I will. Well, there's some health for it. We can keep out for a big dude then. Pierce Rogers. Hell Knights are no match for that now, like, they're just so easy to kill with that. Ammo belt. Some shells. What 
what is going on. Oh, it's not ready to use. Where's our rocket launcher? We're dead. Yep, that's the end of them. We are completely out of ammo for that now. Nice. Quick save it there. We'll have to see what number that is. Number 8. Just take a look for some ammo for this. I don't think we're getting it. What was going on in here? What is this all about? Like. Lab coats need it. Yep, I thought I could hear one lamb. Ah, I tried to shoot that. Got a quick save. We're gonna pick that up. We must be full on this. Let's use this then for a while if we're full. Save some ammo and everything else. Hello? Oh, you dirty weep! I heard another one. Maybe I didn't. Where you at, Imp? Where you are? Now we can have a wee look about. PDA, lovely. Wish it didn't even look about. Last point to give us our security clearance, but Pierce Rogers, thought who it was? Nope, Richard Davis. Let's have a wee look about and then we'll read this. Oh, I read it now. Richard Davis. User, oh no, user data. Discovery in the ruins. This is the scientific journal of Dr. Richard Davis, dated August 8, 2145. We've just broken through to a new chamber and. I think I found the map alluded to on one of the tablets. The artifact is constructed into the ceiling, and it is a magnificent find. It what appears to be made of some crystalline material, and even after all this time, it is still emitting a soft glow. The markings on it were strangely familiar when I first observed it, and after digitizing it and analyzing it, I'm certain this is a map of our solar system. It seems to show a connection between Mars and Earth. My current working theory is that the last survivors used the teleportation technology to escape to Earth. The ramifications of this are overwhelming. This may end up proving that we are actually descendants of this race, and what we are exploring is our own history. I'm going to report my findings as soon as we finish the excavation, and they should show up in corporate within a few days. These are truly exciting times. Log out. Discovering the ruins, Mr. Davis. <clears throat> I want to clear the throat. I received word of your discovery. Very impressive start, but I am not yet convinced. I'll smoke my trigger sign on this. Do not lose sight of the bigger picture. We still have a lot of work to do before any of these findings will be ready for disposition or publication. Analysts, mu anal analyze, analysts must, analysts <laughs> must continue on remaining on, on, on the analysts on the. Analysts must continue on the remaining artifacts. There we go. Your audio, your audio reports in the future need to be more anal, anal, analytical. Analytical? Analytical? I think that's what it is. And less emotional. It's important that we all maintain our professionalism and do not become based or too attached to our work. I do not want to remind you of this again. Continue to forward me your findings and I will help. You manage your reports as so as not to give corporate the wrong impression. Malcolm for trigger. Well, am I reading this terrible today? T 
terrible every day. Hey, Dick. <laughs> the struggle, the structural integrity of the ruins is deteriorating. Our initial rock from rock form and in ground al analysis prior to deep ground exploration interfered no immediate dangers. In fact, the ruin structure itself was determined to be very sound. As you already know, expansive underground digs of this nature and an are an engineering nightmare. The heightened pressure to open up the primary dig site was a dangerous oversight. Just recently, one of our engineers, Peter, got crushed by a falling brick. Yep, those huge stones lining the entire wall and ceiling of the ruins. Some of the guys are mumbling about the walls being alive or something, but you and I know it's just a horizontal stretching of the regional te tectonic stresses. Hey, stones alive. Hey, stones alive. Spooky. I think we all need a long vacation. Anyway, watch your step and don't forget to look up once in a while. Fortunate, right? Tablets are key. I thank you for your indust industrious support. Industry and industrious. <laughs> there we go. Industrious report support of the work being conducted here. I have been complying all your data along with mine and have made some startling new discoveries. I firmly believe your work with the tablets here are are the key to solving the mysterious relationship between the Soul Cube, the Ancients, and us. The Ancients. I am sending word to the Executive Council for an immediate increase of our research budget. I have a strange feeling that we must find the answer soon, or no, I dare not to say it just yet. I will contact you post haste with any news regarding our funding, Pierce. Well, we're looking for you, Pierce. Where are you? Ah, oh, this is the way we go. Guys, my cannot read worth a fuck. <laughs> you fart bean. I'm out of here. Get out of my way. Ah, oh, he's hit me up. Fudge you, fucker. Ah, yeah. I was a bit short there, mate. Got a wee quick save there. I see hell. Whoa. Some reflexes there. Thank you. Obviously, we can't get this way with it. Where are you at, Pierce Rogers? You're holding us all back. You go. So, back it is then. Oh, there we go. Maybe that's the way that we came, is it? I honestly don't know. Maybe not. What is going on here? Whoa. Get out a wee quick save. Oh! Good job. It looks like the Doom guy looked on it. Like the first Doom cover of the game. The fourth tablet details how the essence of each individual was captured and placed in the artifact we now refer to as the Soul Cube. This device was wielded by their mightiest warrior. Are you sure you killed them? But you have the Soul Cube. Just like in the carvings I've been researching. If I'm correct, that cube is our only chance to stop this. No time to explain now. You need to get to the caverns quickly. Take That's my Dave. It's right there on the desk. It's got security codes for the area and my research logs. Another PDA. It'll help. I can't go with you. I need to finish my work here. Good luck. All right, man. That's definitely my Dave from World of Warcraft, like. And Heroes of the Storm. Absolutely, like. Right, let's read Pierce, Mor Pierce Rogers and Pierce Rogers, look at all his emails. The Soul Cube is the answer. I don't know if I'll make it all the way 
much time, so I'll sum up what I have quickly and upload the rest of my findings into the data bank. I hope someone finds them. It was all on the stone tablets, all the answers. I can't believe we never saw it. It was as plain as day. If we had only slowed down the development of the teleporters and tried to really learn what the tablets were trying to tell us, trying to warn us. The ancient people battled the same demons that are attacking us now. The demons came through the teleporters that they built, just like now. They created the soul cube and used it to stop the demons, to drive them back to hell. I don't know how, but that must be the answer. That is why that artifact was left behind, left for someone to find if something like that ever happens again. I can't reach Delta from here. I won't make it. And I truly hope and pray someone finds the soul cube. And it helps. Lord, help us. End of vlog. Got our result. Pierce, the scanner results for the ceiling craving carvings are back and I can say without a doubt that this map of this is a map of our solar, our solar system. There is a very clean indication that Earth may have been a possible teleport destination for the survivors of this area. The dates of these artif artifacts are correct. There is a distinct possibility that we could be the descendants of this race. I can barely comprehend how immense this is. All the struggles we've had in the past year have suddenly become trivial, Richard. Thanks. Uncle Pierce, Mum says you're going to get to see you next month. We're going to get to see you next month. I can't wait. You've been away so long. I hope your project is still going well. I know you can't tell me about it, but your work always sounds so exciting and mysterious. Working on Mars must be really cool. Thanks for sending me the video games for my birthday. Have you tried these? The new Quake 34 ga 43 game <laughs> blows my mind. It is even better than the Super Turbo Turkey Puncher. I haven't played that since I got these new ones from you. Love you, and we miss you a lot, Timmy. P.S. Mom says hi. The Soul Cube is the answer. Server send failure. Unable to send link to orbital communication satellite. Please contact IT system as generator. By code five zero four to Elizabeth. I can only play. I can only. Not, I can. Only, I can now only beg for your forgiveness. You were right about everything. I wish that you had been wrong and that I had somehow. Been in a nightmare that I will soon wake up from. Now I can only pray that this message reaches you. But Trigger is mad and things have gone got have gone worse than you could have imagined. Now your banishment from the Mars from Mars has been ble a blessing in disguise. A slightly saved your life. You must get the word out. The answer is the Soul Cube ob object. It's always been. Listen to my report. I will upload my finding to the data bank. Warn them all, you must not let this spread to the earth. God bless you, Peter. Alright, let's send her on. PDAs are absolute nightmare to read. So we got clearance there. Ah, oh, get away! Pick some long grenades, I certainly will. We'll give it a wee quick save. So we have to work our way back. And we're going to be fighting our way back, I would say. Oh, you hit me through that, can't you? Oh, you do not take the second shot at me, boy. That's the way that we came up. Which way did we go this way? Yep. Two shots from that distance away. Right, where are you at, Revenant? There you are. Coming in, are you? You fart thing. Oh, he's about to fire the shot off there. 
All right, guys, so we're at the half an hour mark. Let's see if we can do this ending a bit better because I fucked the last one up. So, guys, hope you're all enjoying the playthrough so far and hope you've enjoyed episode 27. Remember, if you want to stay up to date with my Doom 3 playthrough, subscribe to the channel. If you like this video, give it a wee thumbs up. Until next time, guys, take care.